Maybe you've heard this one before. There's a person walking in the streets in New York City and they stop somebody and they say, can you tell me how to get to Carnegie Hall? And the person says, practice, practice, practice. So in our lives, when we start to explore spiritual principles, we can have you know, epiphanies and like right away we can see massive shifts in our life and it feels good. But then what happens is we kind of plateau at that spot for a while and even worse is after a while like you know the things that drove us nuts before, the things that caused us pain and friction, those things still keep happening and so for a lot of people that discourages them and they decide that like this philosophy, these practices don't work and then they go back to feeling like you know they're victims in the world that they just have no control over what happens and that ends up being where they're at the key is to practice 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 when we have that spiritual epiphany and awakening we need to continually remind ourselves of that and recognize that those things that pop up in life that cause us the challenge and the pain they're not there to deter us they're there to encourage us to expand into even larger growth and the more that we do that the more that we get to see the shifts in the world and the ripple effect of showing up knowing that we are part of something bigger and the way that we want to see the world is the way that we act in the world and when we do that shift really does happen but the key is to not go back to sleep thinking that it doesn't work we have to just continually show up day in day out remind ourselves of what we are which is infinite divine beings and let that be our guiding light so come see us this Sunday for the meditation at 10 o'clock. The service is at 1030. Center for Spiritual Living, Cape Coral. We welcome you with open arms.